On May 12, 2014, the Board of County Commissioners received a letter with employment complaints from three commanders within the Sheriff's Office. The letter included a wide variety of allegations against the Sheriff, acting in his capacity as Sheriff, and asked the Board of County Commissioners to, quote, initiate an investigation into the activities of the Sheriff's Office during Terry McKee's term as the El Paso County Sheriff, end quote. The Board of County Commissioners initiated that investigation on May 13, 2014. Portions of the investigation are underway at this time. Based on verified information provided, we believe that leadership within the Sheriff's Office has been compromised along with functionality within the office. While the documents reviewed to this date do not show any illegal activity, and while this public statement does not affirm any employment-related claims or accusations, there is a possibility that additional information can subs subsequently come forward which could result in further turmoil within the Sheriff's Office, reducing the ability of the Sheriff to adequately lead and administer his office. The Board notes that Sheriff Terry McKee's policy and personnel manual, which is available on his public website, offers the following statement regarding conduct in an officer's private life. Quote, Police officers will behave in a manner that does not bring discredit to their agencies or themselves. A police officer's character and conduct while off-duty must always be exemplary, thus maintaining a position of respect in the community in which he or she lives and serves. The officer's personal behavior must be beyond reproach. In the same policy and personnel manual, a statement about integrity notes, quote, the public demands that the integrity of police officers be above reproach. The statement concludes, Respect from the public cannot be bought. It can only be earned and cultivated, end quote. At this time, the Board of County Commissioners believes there is disruption to the smooth and efficient administration and functions of the Office of the Sheriff. The Board believes Sheriff Makita has lost the ability to appropriately lead the Office of the Sheriff. The Board of County Commissioners has a responsibility, in partnership with other elected offices, to ensure the efficient operations of all county offices on behalf of the public and to provide the foundation for the efficient daily operations of all county offices and departments. To that end, and based on current distractions and disruptions that compromise functionality and the public trust, I move that the Board of County Commissioners today supports a vote of no confidence in Sheriff Terry Nikita and publicly ask him to resign his office effective immediately. Second. And some of them have expressed to me that every day that goes by without the resignation of the Sheriff, is like a slap in the face to them. It's a slap in the face to some of those 800 employees who are rightfully held to high standards and conduct themselves that way on and off duty. Our Sheriff has chosen to exclude himself from those high standards that were articulated earlier by Commissioner Layton. Again, it is up to the Sheriff to make the decision. I think this Board has to send a strong message. But if he does elect to stay in office, there's corrective action that I believe is absolutely important. I think we need to schedule immediately uh, a presentation from the sheriff. I want to know how he's actually going to address my issue with regard to the functionality. How are you going to actually be able to, to carry out business and talk to people, especially with so many people that are on administrative leave? Are they going to come back? How are you going to fill the vacancies? What's the process for that? I also want to see monthly budget updates because there was concern that there wasn't a level of fiscal accountability. Well, I'm extremely disappointed to have to consider this action. I join my fellow commissioners in stating my personal vote of no confidence and request for the sheriff's resignation. 